This is Arthur Cribbs with my fourth vlog post for our visual communications class in the fall of 2019. And for this episode, I'll be talking about what we did in our visual, visual communications class on Monday, as well as talk about our most recent assignment. So in class, we went over our snap stories from homecoming. Uh, since I was away for work during the weekend of homecoming, I missed out on the step show and the tailgate and yard fest. Um, so I ended up covering a panel discussion about athlete activism, which featured Michael Eric Dyson, Eton Thomas, and Bill Roden. And that was an event that I enjoyed just because they talked about a topic that I'm interested in, which is whether or not athletes are doing enough um, from an activism standpoint. It wasn't an event that was highly talked about just because it was in the beginning of the week and because most people like at homecoming for the concerts and the big events and so I enjoyed that and enjoyed covering that. We also went over storyboarding in class to prepare for our final project, which is an interactive timeline on any topic. Mine is about the men's basketball team here at Howard. When people look at Howard, they usually don't think about athletics, but I think that will soon change uh, given the recent changes with the basketball team. Uh, they have a new head coach and that head coach has already attracted two major high school recruits who may consider Howard uh, as freshmen next year. And that's Maker McCurr and Josh Christopher. Both are among the 12 best high school basketball players. And so if they end up coming to Howard, that can really change the program and change the way people look at HBCU sports. And so I hope to tell the story of the transformation of the basketball team with my project. We also have an interactive timeline for this week, um, and it's about 10 significant moments in our lives. And so I just gathered all the photos that I had and started as early as my birth through early education and the high school I went to. And I also shared uh, the different countries I've been to just because travel has been a major part of my life and has affected the ways that I've seen the world. And so I enjoyed working on this project just because we worked on different forms of media um, while still telling the story of our lives.